Suddenly we're doing another vlog, Sam. Oh, Yeah, man. fuck's sakes. Another. This is the fifth damn vlog. Serious happiness house. So, Sam, you went to the eye doctor today to find out what the hell was the matter with your eyes. Yeah, I did. I went to the eye doctor and did that. And it turns out that my eyes are fine. But I noticed you're still wearing glasses. Yeah, so about three years ago I had another eye test and it turns out that um, I'm basically blind. Um, now that that I needed some glasses, need prescription, but also I was kind of, you know, just a fucking sport little brat and I was like, I want glasses! Um, Have you seen that video of that guy who is like... He used to have glasses, but now he just focuses really hard on shit with his eyes. Really? He took them off, he's like, all you need to do is just focus really hard on shit. And he just does that. And he's bald. He just focuses really he's hard. He's a YouTuber. I don't know who he is. I think he might be tangentially related to the intellectual dark web. Do you know about them? That's Jordan Peterson and all those, uh -huh. all those cats. The intellectual dark web. Yeah, they think they're really important. Uh-huh. They call Imagine calling yourself the intellectual dark web. That sucks. That's that's like that's like coming up with a nickname for yourself and trying to get everyone to call you that. It's got that same kind of dumb steers to it. Uh-huh. The intellectual dark web. Yeah, it's like imagine if I good. wanted you to just call me like Darkwing Joel from now on. You wouldn't go along or, um, with it. Uh, Joel Caliber. That was a low blow, Sam. <laughs> it's, uh, yeah, it's hey, totally embarrassing. You know what, Sam? I was your age when I came up with that shit. Oh, wow. Yeah. Pretty impressive. That's pretty impressive, man. You know what I'm doing at my age? Being Living a fuck. Currently still at my age, unlike you, who's moved on from that age. Ah. Uh, what the fuck? Yeah, Who I does got that? Who does that? Who gets older? Has been. Has been. The Beach Boys. I'm like as old as Tom Cruise now. Tom Cruise is awesome. Tom Cruise isn't awesome. Tom no. Cruise is a weird, weird guy. Yeah, but he it's runs really fast in every movie that he's in. Really fast. Every movie with Tom Cruise, he runs so fast. There's just always a shot of him running really fast. You know what? I feel a bit like Tom Cruise in the moment. Cause like like a acting. weird guy? I'm acting. I'm acting. Um, but this is like not like an acting thing, because this is regular life, I'm just sitting here. We just got a camera, but I feel like I'm acting. Well... And I'm talking to you, but I'm talking to you in a way that I'm trying to be interested yeah, in the camera. Yeah, I, I know. Like it. It's strange. I'm holding... It's weird to look at you and like in my peripherals, I'm looking at the viewfinder on the camera trying to make sure you're centered. And you're trying to say things that are entertaining. I guess I am. For an audience that, that is never going to see... That doesn't part. even exist! But... There are vloggers who vlog, like, I, this is not Andy Trump, he's a skater vlogger. Okay. <laughs> not trying to be entertaining. Did I'm just being myself. I do this every day. You talk in this way? Every day? I can't help what I'm feeling. You know what? Every day? You know what? What? There's this guy, Andy Trump, and he's a vlogger. Okay. And he's constantly vlogging. He's been doing it for the past five years. He's on the constant vlog. He's on the constant vlog syndrome. Um, what? Uh, how is he? How's he doing? Because he's got the vlog on and he's got to be completely entertaining and funny all the time. Because he's kept constantly vlogging. You know what, what is he like when he's not vlogging? You know what I guess it's like? He doesn't know. Maybe it's like um, people who are constantly surrounded by peers and they get to. Like Nashi peers? Green peers. Well, peer, whichever kind of peers can reciprocate some kind of feeling. Uh huh. And so they're always they're always playing it up. Uh huh. Because if you're surrounded by people who care what you have to say, then I guess you're constantly trying to excite those people, aren't you? See, this is why in the previous vlog we talked about you walking into the room and me doing a funny, silly thing. Right. Because I feel the pressure from my peers, peer pressure, 
to act, oughtn't it to just be entertaining? You know? Well, there you have it. We've gotten to the bottom of this thing. Mm. It's only that, well, what difference does a camera make? Huh, Sam? Well, but it I does, need to find out. It does something, because it's not, it's not, uh, well, it is consequential. Because now we're having this discussion that we otherwise wouldn't have had. Uh-huh. And I don't know if it's because there's a potential audience ready and waiting to gobble up this content, or if it's just no. the idea of something like that. Well, I think uh, there's been so many vloggers doing something similar to this, to press be able to use our imaginations to pretend that there is an audience for us. We're not even vlogging. There's no one even watching this. Like, to be honest. I know. Yeah, if we take away the camera, I can just do this. Yeah, but put the camera up. I but like, no, no. I, I like, I like. You need it. I need the camera. You need it. God, you look amazing. <sighs> this is the longest vlog to date. Yeah, this is a good vlog. This is, this is hashing some shit out. Yeah, man. It's probably boring. No, this is soul bearing. You know who's going to be watching? <laughs> soul bear. Shit. Shout outs to soul bear. Soul bear. Shout outs to Jesus. Well, I think today, folks, we've gotten somewhere. Mm. I don't know which one, which way focuses on me. Do you want to play us out, Sam? We're gonna play this vlog out. Serious happiness house is where you want to be. If you wanna go to a house, 